Good morning, y'all. I just thought I'd check in. I am, uh, I made it to Mississippi, and I'm in Gulfport, Gulfport, Mississippi. Um, I drove through Biloxi. That was my original intention, and that motel did not work out. And so I drove a little farther down the road. Um, and so uh, it was a long day. Uh, and, and kind of odd and unusual things happened, including taking a, a walking tour of Auburn, Alabama by accident. <laughs> when you do Google Maps, make sure you're on driving directions, not walking. It took me 45 minutes to find my way back to the highway um so anyway it was a long day and nothing nothing really eventful happened other than my silliness and distraction and it was a long drive um it wasn't even 300 miles apparently i can't drive 300 miles because it takes me like six hours at least <laughs> so um, today I'm, I'm, I'm attempting to cross Louisiana, and it could be done, so we'll see. I might get an early start, I don't know. Anyway, um, here I am, making my way, not to the halfway point yet, um, I think after today's drive I'll be about halfway home. And I'm looking forward to a wood stove, looking forward to standing up straight when I'm at my house, because, you know, I can't do that in the camper. I'm always bent down like this. No wonder my neck and my shoulders and my back and my leg hurts. <laughs> I've been in this thing for, you know what, we designed it so I could live in it, but I don't want to have to. If I if I can help it because <laughs> it's especially in the winter not a good time but uh, anyway I have tried to make this video multiple times just to check in it keeps getting long and long and long and telling y'all stories about stuff that happened and, and I'm thinking y'all don't need to know about the roaches in the motel and, and the dude who tried to sell me gold jewelry outside my truck at the gas station and got real close to my truck and dropped a piece in and I was like please I don't know and finally I gave him $20 to go away oh apparently I'm at the airport or not at the airport but close enough um I don't know what it was. <laughs> Seems to, I think it was the airplane. Anyway, uh, I just wanted to say that I love y'all and I want to wish you a Shabbat Shalom. And I want to thank you for all your prayers and your kind words and your encouragement. It really helps. I'm going to take, go take care of the bud man. He's awake now. I love y'all.